Ahoy! What's up, guys? Thanks for checking me out during the day. So, basically, to, to install this thing, um, you download it and you run the game, and then it just does this install thing. So, it's downloading the whole mod, but for some reason, um, at the end, it said error with archthrones.bdt, which is weird because it should have just installed. So instead of hitting continue, I hit retry. And after I hit retry, it started downloading the whole goddamn thing again. So I literally started streaming. I was like, oh, it's done downloading. We're good to go. But I hit retry thinking it would just try to re-input the hook or whatever. But instead, it restarted the whole friggin' thing. So, you know, I didn't want to just end stream after like 10 seconds. So, um, we're just going to talk and hang out, kick it. Um, you know, until this thing's done downloading. But basically, this is like step one. And when it's done downloading, um, it just like breezes through a whole bunch of other steps real quick. So, we're just going to hang out while this uh, downloads. Why not? I got a bunch of memes and stuff that we could entertain ourselves with, so not too worried about it. Just uh, kind of frustrating. <laughs> but what are you going to do? This is the install. So I downloaded the mod, and you run the, the game normally, and it has a different DLL file that it hooks to instead of the regular DS3 one. And when you do that, it just downloads the mod um, as archthrones slash archthrones.bdt. And I have that folder completely set up and it's ready to roll. It just gave me an error message. So, <laughs> so I feel like worst comes to worst, this is a educational thing where we could figure out what I'm doing wrong or people can tell me that it's just not gonna work. And uh, we could do whatever, but I'm gonna stream for a couple hours, maybe three hours, take a break, eat some dinner, and then we're gonna do the Legendary Legend League tonight. So I'm gonna make a brand new character for the league that is gonna be terrible for invasions, but it's gonna be really strong for legging. So I'm just gonna do everything that I could possibly do in the game um, that lets you ledge somebody, that, that forces somebody away from you. So. It's going to be terrible as far as uh, strength goes, but as far as ledging people, it's going to be a really good build, so. Uh, no, so you have a separate folder for your, um, for your DS3 mods. So I have like a folder that says um, DLL mods and another... Um, mod that's dll that's lazy loader that loads different dlls to make the game work so the arch thrones mod is in a separate arch thrones folder that the d input 8 dll that came with the mod hooks to that folder and that makes this show up on my screen so to make regular dark souls 3 show up all i have to do is replace the d input 8.dll file that came with the mod with my original one um and it'll load dark souls 3 up normally so it doesn't change any part of the original DS3 um, install. It just hooks in a different DLL.
Yeah, I just reread the README. Everything should make sense. So I don't see why it gave me an error message, but it did. Yeah, the, the error message was uh, was this. Archthrones.bdt error. That's uh, that's what it said. And then it, I said retry, and it just started re-downloading the whole thing. But thanks for any and all help. I appreciate it. What's up, Noble Houndoom? Uh, it's going well. I just, I finished installing this right before I started stream, and I thought it was going to work, so I started stream, but... It ended up giving me an error message. So instead of hitting continue anyway, or I think proceed, I hit um, retry. I thought it was just going to retry pushing the mod through, but instead it started re-downloading the whole thing. So I feel like at worst, people can watch this as an <laughs> educational thing and see, you know, maybe see what I did wrong or, you know, obviously I'm not going to hit retry next. I'm going to hit continue anyway and hope we can get it to work. But um, my Arch Thrones um, .bdt file has zero kilobytes as size in my DS3 folder right now. So it's definitely downloading. It didn't um, save the last download. What's up, One Infinity? Yo, what up, hyena gal? How you living? Hey, guys, look, I've been learning um, some sign language stuff. So this is me telling you you're all my little pod champs. You are my little P-O-G champs. Bam. Hello, you are my little hard champs. <laughs> Hyena, are you feeling, are you feeling exceptionally beautiful today? How's that California life treating you? <laughs> One infinity with the with the emote showcase. Let's go. Let's go. Pogged and champ with the vape right next to you. Well, I made this brand new uh, playlist today, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. Let me know if it's too loud or anything. I just need to go through and actually organize the playlist. I just have it shuffling right now, but I really, um, actually, while we're waiting here, I'll just fucking go through it right now. Fuck it. All right. There we go. Bum, bum, banana, banana, na, na, na. Camera is too high. What do you mean by that, Porker? You want to see my, uh, my swole chest? You better watch out, guys. Nobody understands I'm actually, like, quite a fucking st strong human being. Which I, it's like, yeah, like, in real life, <laughs> like, in real life, like, nobody, nobody talks shit to me. It never happens because they. I just kind of walk walk into them, looking them dead in the face, and they're just like, "Oh my god, sorry, man, I didn't mean it. It was just a joke." But like online, they people see like a rainbow potato, and they just for some reason they're compelled to try to fucking shit talk. It's just like, dog, if this was real life, you you would be like, uh, "I'm not gonna mess with that guy." But Online as a as a floating omniscient, five hundred foot tall rainbow potato from the Skittles galaxy. People just want to fucking, I don't know why. What do they call me? <laughs> fucking 
human penis cancer. <laughs> Fucking incredible. Yeah, we're going to try to get, um, there we go. I'm going to start playing through my playlist without any shuffles or anything. I'm going to organize it as we go so that I can get, uh, a nice playlist going. I want a nice mix of uh, dance music, video game music, upbeat music. Pretty sure I could cradle you like a baby. Really? Shadow Porker, you and I fucking bouncing the, the Twitch club? <laughs> I'm, I'm 5'11", 220. <laughs> With like a 20 BMI. So I got, I, had some, I got some weight to lose, but... Usually when I get slimmer, I don't really lose weight. I just gain more muscle mass. It's all fun and games until they get into punching distance. Well, Noble, I, I got an incredibly strong grip. So what people don't understand is like they could punch me and I, it doesn't look it might look like it. I have a gigantic head that's very strong and I have a very strong neck. So like I've been punched in the face while talking to a friend and I literally didn't even feel it. Like I've had a, I've had a friend literally look at me and go like, dude, that guy just punched you in the face. I was like, no, nah, he didn't. I would have felt it if he did. And he's like, I'm telling you. And I look over and this dude's standing right there like, are you some sort of F word? Like he didn't say, are you F word? But he asked me if I was gay with a slur. <laughs> Champion of the sun. <laughs> yeah, what are you, some sort of F word? And I was like, what the fuck if I am? What are you going to do about it? And he, he tries to punch me again, and I just put him in a chokehold. It's like, it's like my signature move. I was going, dude, like, oh, shit, I hit my mic. I was just like, dude. Just, are you gonna stop? Like, what are you gonna, what are you doing? What the fuck is the point of this? There's no point in this. <laughs> I did put the mic in a chokehold. Yeah, it should have effed him till he loved me. Yeah, that that's a really funny story. I was um, um, my friend was on tour with um, what's his name? He's a pretty famous DJ. I can't remember his fucking name right now, but my friend was opening for him in Slow, uh, San Luis Obispo. And I was in the VIP area talking to my roommate. I was just like, dude, I'm so happy I met you. I'm so happy we're roommates. I love you, man. You're one of my favorite dudes. And this guy comes and goes, what are you, gay? But he said it with the slur. And I was like, what if I am? Like, what the fuck are you going to do about it? And he, and he swung on me. So I put him in a chokehold. That's like my move. And uh, the bouncer was his brother, so they fucking kicked me out. It was AC Slater, that's the DJ. They kicked me out, so I'm just yelling at the bouncer, like, at the top of my lungs, like, you don't even know who you're fucking with right now, man. Like, I, I am VIP, and you're fucking being, a, like, the worst. And it was at uh, the, uh, the Graduate in Sloan. <laughs> yeah, who do you think? <laughs> So, so my buddy who opened for him finished his set and AC Slater was about to go on. And he, he pokes his head out and he goes, he goes, oh, dude, I just got your text and like your missed calls. Like what happened? I was like, some dude called me the F word and I fucking locked his ass up and they kicked me out. He goes, oh, fuck this place. And he just goes and tells AC Slater, hey, you remember uh, my friend? And he said my name. And he's like, you remember Turpy? And, he, and he's like, yeah, they like, he just, he, they just kicked him out. We're done here. And AC Slater goes, okay. And he, he just stops his set. All of his people, like, it, it's funny. One of his setup dudes were, was born in the same town that I was born in, in Connecticut. So, like, we had, like, a lot of bonding time before they went up. Like, we became boys. And we ended up walking, like, a mile down the road to a Denny's at, like, one in the morning and just fucking, uh, there were, like, 12 of us. We just fucking ate grand slams and, and fucking talk shit about the place for like three hours and then my friend uh Corey, her mom had a uh, rv that she set out 
um, in the driveway with all these Gatorades and snacks like Doritos and Cheetos and shit with a note that was just like, hope you guys had a great show. Uh, enjoy all the snacks you want. Because we didn't have, there was no hotel we wanted to stay in or anything. So we just, <laughs> like, I slept on the dashboard of the RV. Other people slept, like, on the counter. Like, we were people on the floor. <laughs> And the whole time we're just talking shit at how fucking stupid the graduate was. Like, <laughs> that was so funny. Sorry if that wasn't the most uh, entertaining story, but oh my God, it was hilarious at the time. Yo, Donnie with a 20 stream streak. Let's go. <laughs> uh, by big manly orgy, if you mean we all fell asleep and accidentally cuddled on each other, then yes. <laughs> but we were so tired, man. Like, I can't tell you how tired we were. <laughs> but those are the days in my 20s where I, I, like, regularly woke up snuggling one of my friends. Whether, you know, male, female, trans, bi like, non-binary, like, whatever the fuck, I didn't care. <laughs> the, the amount of substances I used... And just the affection that I have for almost everybody. I didn't care. If you were in reaching distance while I was fucking snoozing, I was, I was bear hugging you and fucking snuggling with him. <laughs> I actually posted in the Discord a while ago a lot of my fucking pics when I was a, when I was a raver and a, and a partier. Isn't the rule a hole in a heartbeat? I never heard that rule, but I'm fucking down. Oh, um, let me get back to... Uh, let me get back up to uh, making this playlist. <laughs> this is going to be good. Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah. I hate how long it takes to shuffle up on Spotify. Can I zoom out on this shit? I can zoom out. Let's go gaming. Oh shit, now I lost my place. There we go. Bing bong, biddly bing bong. That seems like a good place for a bit. We'll add a little bit later on. Perfect. We got a good few hours on this mix all set. We're still waiting for the friggin' mod to download. <laughs> What's up, OPKG? Welcome to the uh, amazingly suspenseful uh, bar loading uh, stream. <laughs> Get ready, guys. Get ready for the best remix ever. We're going to blast this while we're waiting. If you know the lyrics, sing along. Black gate, 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 gate. Black gate, 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 gate. <laughs> you order DS3? Let's go. Uh, no, the 
Um, <laughs> the only spoilers would be like um, um, the graphic, the way the graphics look. But from what I've seen, every area in this game is completely different. It's set up like Demon Souls is, where you have different arch stones to enter different areas. Whereas DS3 is a more linear experience without being able to choose, pick and choose where you go. <laughs> when I was young, I used to be really poor, but 30 years later, I am no longer young. I am no longer young. Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, you should play DS3. This game's amazing. It's my favorite game. And DJ, I'm on PlayStation and um, PC. So if you want, um, if you want some gaming, you let me know. If you want a Bubba, you fucking, you let me know, bud. I will go on a limb and say openly that I'm the best DS3 Bubba you could ever ask for. I love that game. And OPKG is here. I think he'll agree that I'm the best Bubba ever for DS3. <laughs> That's a fact. Let's go. And Sleepy is my best Bubba for DS3. That's the, uh, that's the difference. Hitting urban concrete, I'm the man, untestable, with the extraterrestrial flow, 456 ELO, got the tops off the bottom, house bottle, Hello, I'm not the role model. Do the bullshit, and get up off these, and save the confessions for G's. The sun will still come out tomorrow, as long as I'm breathing, and even like Steve. Eva, I amaze you. You know what I want? When I play with Terpy on DS3, I'm the one getting carried. I love DS3 so much, man. I can't tell you how much I love it. <laughs> I'll try to beat this game like a gamer, but most likely I won't succeed. Dude, do whatever you got to do, man. There's no spirit summons, but there's still ways to make everything manageable. I just, my number one piece of advice for your first playthrough is explore everything. The, the early game of DS3 has a lot of strong stuff that you can use the rest of the game. And a, it, a lot of people overlook the very beginning of the game. Not the first area, but the second area, which is really the first. It has a tutorial area and then, a, and then an actual first area. How can you ask for my help in Discord? Yeah, man. The DS3 channel, just at me. Hold on, guys. I'm getting a phone call. I don't know who this could be. I'll be right back. Okay, well, that was weird. <laughs> Somebody just called me. Hello? <laughs> I'm like, hello? Wh who's calling? Uh, your cousin Andrew. I don't have a cousin Andrew. <laughs> he goes, is this George? Nope. Oh, okay, well, have a great day. <laughs> Yeah, what's up, Hammer? <laughs> I 
I don't think Donnie even knows what the classes are. I think he's going in blind. But um, I will say that um, you'll be able to tell what the strongest base class is in DS3 because it's the same as uh, Elden Ring, pretty much. They pretty much copy-pasted a lot of the classes from, uh, from DS3 into Elden Ring, so... If if the, if you would say the vagabond is overall the best class in Elden Ring, then there is a class in DS3 that is also the best class. Yeah, Nightabond. Subscribed with Prime. Yo, Christy, thank you so much for the Prime sub. Appreciate you so much. What's up, fellow Floridian? I think he just I think he just bought it. So I don't even know if it's installed yet. Hey, Christy, thanks so much for the support. <laughs> I love Catboy Terpy. He's so happy and excited. <laughs> I don't know why this is downloading so slow. It was downloading as like this slow um, when I was off stream too. I don't know why. <laughs> you'll have it like tomorrow let's go yeah dj like i i have no problem streaming being your bubba in ds3 um i don't have much off time because i'm building the shed and i get my uh drywall delivery tomorrow so construction is going to start heavily tomorrow but um you know if i'm on if i'm on stream and you want to let me know, like, hey, man, while you're streaming, I would love for you to be my bubba. I'd be like, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> I love DS3, so. And at this point, like, my big goal was to make partner, but I need to average 75 viewers for eight streams in two months. And I ain't averaging 75 viewers yet. That just ain't happening. People want to watch chainsaws and, you know, double pike users and just people that are just destroying the game. They don't want to watch silly cosplayers that, you know, they die 10% of their invasions instead of 5%. Blah. Um, but our community is getting really fucking solid. We're like, I may not have a lot of numbers, but I got really quality people going on. So I'm kind of forgetting about the whole pushing for partner and just focusing on the community. So you know, streaming DS3 will probably get me less viewers overall, but, you know, it'll be super quality content and I'll have a blast. So I'm super into it. I, um, yeah, big realization lately that, um, I don't need to make partner in order to have a quality community. So it's just a little check. And if I keep going, it should happen eventually. So I'm not stressing about it anymore. DS3 was your first Souls game? Me too. I tried it in 2016, and I did not beat the tutorial boss, so I gave it up, and I started playing Rocket League and Smite. And I ended up being a grand champion in every single uh, category in Rocket League. Um, played a bunch of zombies in Call of Duty, and then um, came back to Dark Souls 3 in 2021, and loved it. I was so upset that I didn't continue in 2016. And now I'm just thinking, man, like imagine if I had five more years of experience under my belt of claw gripping and reactioning to everything. Uh, this same dude just called me back. I'm going to block him. He sounded a little bit strange. I'll block him. Block. No, dude, stop calling me. I'm not George. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I fucking love this song. The issue is your first too? Hell yeah. All right, so I do remember that, um, this bar um, swooshed up around 75% last time. I don't remember exact amount because um, 
I was going back and forth between the shed stuff, but um, should not be waiting too much longer. Except Rock League was Destiny One and COD it was until friends played with me and taught me the game that I actually enjoyed it. Hell yeah! So um, if you played Destiny One, Noble, I was one of those nerds that could solo the Crota raid. I was part of a clan called the Clam Jammers because we were all lady characters and we teabagged everybody because we fucking just wrecked shop in the arenas. Um, so we were called the Clam Jammers. We cl we jammed our clams on everybody. And um, when we couldn't get a group together, I would literally just go in and fucking solo the Crota Raid by myself on all three of my characters. And then the my clan would... Um, would get their shit together and be like, hey, <laughs> you want to join us? And I'd be like, sure. And I had already gotten all the rewards for the week because I just soloed it. <laughs> so, you know, I'm not the best at video games, but when I decide to do something, I pretty much can do it. And that Crota Raid soloing was so goddamn fun, dude. It was so buggy, though. You'd get to Crota, and there's like a 50-50 chance you'd fucking glitch out, and you weren't able to hit him with the goddamn um, rocket launcher. Whatever the fuck that thing was called. Yo, Donnie Jules. Thank you for the gifty to Hyena. Donnie Jules gifted a tier one subscription to Hyena Girl. Hyena, enjoy my new emotes. Enjoy the silliness. Welcome back to the sub club. And Donnie, I really appreciate that, dog. All right, so relatively soon, this bar should just shoot up, and we'll see what happens. Obviously, I'm not going to hit retry at the end. I'm just going to say proceed. Hey! The Donnie Jules gifted Hyena Girl for being a sub to the channel. Thank you so much. Game thing. What the fuck was that? What, what, what was that? What, what the shit? <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna play it again and we're gonna clip it, okay? Hey! The Donnie Jewels gifted Hyena Girl for Gina sub to the channel! Thank you so much! Game thing! What the... What was that? <laughs> oh my god the tech demons have possessed my bot I do remember it Picking up pace, so maybe I'm not mistaken, but I do remember that happening. <laughs> the tech demons have possessed. That's so crazy, man. Well, because I didn't record like scared. I recorded five versions of myself. I recorded happy, sad, angry, neutral, and yelling. That's what I recorded. But that sounded like terrified. Have I called a tech priest to placate the machines, Barrett? I don't know. Roboterpy is my connection to all things AI, so I, I haven't even asked. I haven't asked him at all. Let me ask him. Roboterpy, are you able to perform exorcisms on malfunctioning AI? Terpy, I'm too busy cracking jokes and sharing info to get into the exorcism business. Maybe try upgrading your AI software instead. Plus, I'd miss all the fun with Terpy OG and the crew. 
You're kind of taking it a bit too far there, Robo Derby. I'm just wondering if you could fucking help us. Yo, what a Papa Spoon. Welcome in, dog. The Sky Shot Champion. I can see the eyes and the sky. Higher and higher. Burning in me. Okay, buddy. Okay. Everything's fine, Hyro. There was an amazing string of TT invasions the other night with uh, with Cranky. Yeah, it was great. Cranky was uh, Cranky was the first person on Twitch that said hi to me. Um, I was in Naps chat, and it was like a couple weeks, and I kept saying hi to everybody, and nobody ever responded to me. And one day, Cranky added me and said, hey, welcome back, man. And it felt so nice for somebody to finally re respond to me. Um, he was one of my first mods in the channel. Um, but he had a lot of stuff going on in his personal life, so I removed it. Didn't want to, you know, feel like there was any obligation when he had stuff going on, so. But he's still a big friend of the channel and wish him nothing but the best, man. <laughs> tech priests more like tech geeks these cybernetic servants of the machine god in warhammer 4k are an interesting bunch they're all about upgrading themselves with more metal than a junkyard if you need someone to fix your toaster or perform a techno exorcism, they're your go-to guys. Just make sure to keep an eye on your gadgets around them. They might borrow a few components for their next upgrade. Roboterapy. I didn't know you were a Warhammer 40k nerd. <laughs> he is feeling sassy. He's a sassy boy today. All right, come on, download. We're going to fucking, we're going to push through right now, big guy. I can feel it. Dude, I fucking love this song. What up, Nexus? How you doing, dog? I'm having some issues with the installation, so I thought I'd do it on stream to uh, show people what I'm dealing with, and hopefully we could work through it. Um, or just leave this as some sort of education thing about what I did wrong and uh, post it in the DS3 channel. It just takes a long time. What, the installation? I already, down I already went through the whole installation. But it said error at the end. That's what I'm saying. I already did it, but it said error at the end with uh, archthrones.bdt. So instead of saying proceed, I pressed retry. And uh, it, it re-downloaded the whole thing. Or it's re-downloading the whole thing. I've already waited for it to do this once, but once I, once I hit retry and it started downloading, I was like, well, I'm just going to continue stream. See if we could figure out what the hell's going on live with everybody. And then I'm going to take a little bit of a break around dinner and come back. And we're going to do Legendary Legend League. It's going to be a blast. What's up, Hyro? Am I a good boy? Yeah, 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 yeah.
Why is it so hard for me to find the song that I want? There it is. All right, 86%. We're getting closer. Yeah, what up, Endless? I just downloaded it before stream, but it said error. So I'm doing it again on stream so we can see what the heck's going on. <laughs> yeah, RoboTerpy is a very sarcastic bot. That's his thing. <laughs> Yo, what up, Ghost? How you doing, big guy? Good to see you. <laughs> I hope we don't get an, the same error message. Everything said, I have all my files verified, so I don't have any texture mods or anything, so it should be easy peasy. Hi, Ro, I know. I know you want all the attention. I can't give it to you. I got to I got to look at these screens that you don't understand and talk to strangers on the internet. I know. I know. I know it's terrible. I'm the worst. I'm the worst. Did I go back to 1.15? No, I just downloaded whatever was available. Down patch helped you? Huh. I'll go back to the mod site right now. How do I down patch? Oh, file archive. Oh no, I just see that one. Is it in the forum? The readme file has it on the bottom. Valid Steam copy, Dark Souls 3 version 1.15 and up. Two ways to down pass. Download 1.5 EXE from here. Okay. All right, I'll download that on the side right now. It's the biz marquee. So is it 1.15 or 1.15.1? Probably 1.15. DS3, 1.15, down. Yep. Instantly downloaded. Perfect. Gotcha. People's nexuses are exploding, but 1.15 is all good. All right, well, I'll just put that in there now. That shouldn't be an issue. To the E, it's the biz marquee. Current Dark Souls 3 EXE file. What? Is the charge. I have another down patch for uh, 
The pocket souls, man. All right, I down patched the 1.15. Thank you. That was easy peasy. Only thing, you have to open it through the folder, not Steam. That's easy peasy. Yeah, what a Lieutenant Booty. Yeah, literally easy game made for babies. I have so many edited folders in here with parentheses that are like, remove this DLL for this or that or whatever mod I'm trying to play. But none of that should fuck with the, um, with the mod because it should just hook into the, the folder that it's supposed to. <sighs> Not much, man. Just tired. Not going to lie, you're struggling against these bosses. I've seen some people play. I was watching Error play. He was having a blast. I saw Scorch Knight play. He was having a blast. Don't waste my souls. I ain't a soul waster. We'll see. I'm excited. I love DS3. I love the game engine. So, And if it's a challenge, man, like I was just on a flight the other day. Uh, yesterday it was a three-hour flight. And just for shiggles, I beat DS3. I was just like, you know what? Fuck it. Let's beat DS3. I like. I didn't get any side quests. I didn't. I didn't do anything. I just straight shot through to the end of the game. It took me like an hour and a half or something. <laughs> I was just like, I, I like you know. I have this stupid Dark Souls three ego. So I looked around. And I was like. I wonder how many people here could beat Dark Souls 3 at all, let alone casually just do an hour and a half fucking run of the game. <laughs> no quests, no side things, just fucking murder. <laughs> Top 10 soul wasters. Let's go, Hyena. You could have, you could have that fucking that up plaque if you want. Only tater waste. <laughs> Thanks, Ghost. I appreciate you, man. Always good to see you hanging out. I'm excited. I've had... So many people that know I love Dark Souls 3 come through and uh, and say that I'm going to love it. There's like, dude, you got to try Arch, the Arch Thrones. If you like Dark Souls, this is like a necessity for you. And I'm like, I know. I just uh, I got so much shit going on right now with the construction and the fucking um, uh, doctor's visits that I have. I'm just spread so thin right now. But hopefully by next week, I'll be spread less than I'll be spread thick. Real thick, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, Noble, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say more about that because we have some people that have never played DS3 and I don't want to spoil it, but I will say this Champion Gunder is my favorite boss in any Souls game. The lore, the fighting, the strategies you can use, I just think he's incredible. Do I have a build in mind? None. Zero, zero thought about it. Yo, Hanky, thanks for the 30 stream streak, man. That's amazing. I still can't believe anybody shows up when I stream. I still have this imposter syndrome. Um, I think that people only remember the worst things I've ever said instead of like the 99% positive, helpful person that I am. At the end of the night, when I'm trying to sleep, I have all these fucking memories of like, you could have been nicer to this person. Blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, shut the fuck up. Oh, my God. <laughs> just shut the fuck up. But I will say the AI dude talking as me is kind of helping the mean voices in my head become my own voice, which I wasn't expecting it to be like a form of therapy. I'm your favorite streamer. Thanks, Hanky. Even though I, I like the game Bloodborne and I'm not afraid to admit it. You still like me? Hi, Hyro. What can I do for you? Guys, I'm petting the shit out of Hyro right now because he's like just begging for it. <laughs> Bloodborne's okay. <laughs> but no, guys, seriously, um, like when you say things like that, it really does mean a lot to me. Um, you know, I'm not going to keep twisting about me, but I am going to say that I put a lot of effort into this. I help a lot of people in my community. I spread myself out to a lot of people and it's very rare that somebody goes way out of their way to acknowledge it consistently so that so that people know what my influence is, but trust me, <laughs> there's a lot of people here that have gotten a lot of direct support for me for a long time. 
And for you guys to just say that, you know, you appreciate me really does mean a lot. Thanks, Ghost. I'm super nice to Gort, even though you turn him into Gobble Mush every time we fight. That's not true. I sky shot at him the other night. We, we had a sky shot battle. <laughs> I appreciate it, Ghost. I really do, man. But, you know, there's a lot of different types of clicks in the Twitch world. And uh, honestly, I didn't feel like people respected my PvP prowess until that Jaker tournament. I feel like a lot of people that stick in duels all the time, especially on PlayStation, I think a lot of people were like, I think a lot of people were like, oh, Terpy, he's just that meme guy. He's not that good, whatever. He takes advantage of, you know, reaction rolling and, you know, doesn't really beat talented people. But like for like three days after that Jaker tournament, like people that are really skilled kept showing up to, to stream and going like, yo, Terpy, you did really good. Like I... I cannot tell you how good you you were, man. It was great to see you. And, like, I really have no interest in duels. I've never practiced duels. I just fight people whenever I fight people. But, like, you know, I know at the bottom of my heart that if I studied and if I really just went into duels for, like, a month, I could be a demon. But I just don't like meta setups. They're boring to me. I had a conversation with Russ Bucket in, uh, in Decker's stream the other day. Um, he was saying that people that find things boring are just, they just have a skill issue. And I'm glad that I'm at the point now where I could chime in and be like, listen, Rusty, like I, I respect your opinion, but like, I don't have a skill issue. And I just don't like seeing like 10 different builds in every single duel. It's boring to me. I want to see like straight sword in your right hand and a cross Naginata in your offhand. And I want to see you master it. I don't care if you're going to lose to Power Stance Spears. I don't care if you're going to lose to fucking Halstock. I want to see you try as hard as you can to master a wackadoodle build. That's what I find interesting. I don't think it's interesting when you just use the same shit that everyone else is using. But that's my opinion. I'm not going to tell somebody to stop playing the game they want to play. That's just what I find boring. You know what I mean? All right. It says action done. I'm going to continue. It looks like it's working this time. It looks like there's no error message this time. Oh my God, the FPS. What just happened? Uh-oh. Uh, my game is having severe FPS issues. Ooh, we got different, we got different music. I'm going to pause this music while we uh, read through this. Ooh, it's like a brand new install. The fuck? It won't let me click on it? I gotta manually scroll? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so loud. You guys can't hear it. Let me get this up on screen. It's so loud. Okay, I'm not scrolling. I'm just going to fucking... Oh, there we go. Thank goodness. <laughs> well, I didn't see what you guys all said. Let me uh, let me click through this so I can change the... This is so loud. No, I'm not going to log in. Yeah, offline. Perfect. Oh, my God. This music is so loud. Oh, thank goodness. It was so incredibly loud. I do want to hear it though. Hopefully that's loud enough for you guys. We're going max, baby. I just don't like motion blur off. There we go. All right, let me read what y'all were saying before we get this shindig started. I'm a spacing demon who punishes well. Fuck yeah, thanks ghost. It's because you never really use anything meta. Well, that's the thing, Endless. Before I started streaming, like, you guys gotta understand, like, I did everything meta. For a year, I started streaming 10 months into Elden Ring's life. And for those 10 months, I was 
using everything that was the best. But when the game first comes out, I think that's what you got to do. Like, I think you got to figure out what is the best of the best. And then you kind of go around from there. At least that's what I do. I was using fucking Power Stance Naginatas, Power Stance Curse Sword, Single Sham Shear, uh, Flaming Strike. Um, back then, Curved Great Swords weren't that good. So what was I using it on? Like Claymore, Flaming Strike Claymore. Stormblade would add bleed buildups. So my favorite was Stormblade Claymore on my bleed builds. Shit was disgusting. Um, but I got bored with it. Like when the arena first started, I was just doing meta duels for like two months. And then I just got bored of it. It's just not my cup of tea, you know? But some people try that out and they love it. And they go balls in. They just fucking go for it. And I just, it, it bores me. Like what I look for in these games is finding an honest three piece gaming situation where three gamers are genuinely playing through the level. And my goal is to be the fucking biggest pest that I could possibly be. I wanna attack and retreat, I wanna do guerrilla warfare, I wanna hit them with a cannon from a place they've never known you could get to before. I wanna surprise them with, with corner, uh, like waves of darknesses and finger blasts and just all sorts of shit where they're just like, oh my God, I never saw this coming. Like that's what I, that's what I look for. But like, if I invade three gamers and they're boring ass fucking meta builds, I'm not gonna be a mischievous fuck. I'm just gonna kill them. You know what I mean? But that's what I'm looking for. Other people look for different things. But I'm just glad that I'm that I'm at the point where somebody like Rust Bucket, who's very skilled, can say, you know, so so what you're saying is you look for creativity. You don't look for functionality. And I go, I never look for functionality. I all I care about is creativity. And if it ends up being functional because you're such an artist in these games that you can make it functional, that makes me so happy. And that that that's what's entertaining to me. Like I said, if you can make offhand Naginata work, I'm a big fan of you. But if I lock into your stream and you're spamming Starlight Shards and fucking using Power Stance Bleed fucking Naginatas or fucking Frost Pikes, I'm just like, well, what makes you different than anybody else using that same setup. Like the difference between the outcome of the best duelist using the, the best weapons is very small. There's not much wiggle room for what's gonna happen when they're in an invasion. You might go, oh, they swap faster than this other person, but you're never gonna go like, oh my goodness, they approach this situation with this setup that's so incredibly creative. That's amazing. It's just like, no, they swapped to fucking Frost Pikes and won. It's like, oh, they swapped to Shunter and they crouch poked them into a vortex and did a did a turnaround jumping R1. Oh, amazing. They did it the same thing the last 500 invasions they were in. Like, I'm not saying it doesn't take skill. I'm just saying, like, I don't see the difference between the best of the best when they do, when they use the same weapon types. Like there obviously are differences, but they're very small. Whereas when like, when I swap to different builds and my 200 fucking 150 different builds, you're gonna see me play a completely different style with each build, which means I have to think differently. I have to organize my weapons differently. I have to come up with different ways to approach situations. Whereas you watch somebody like Chase, extremely skilled, extremely smart, but like, he knows exactly which weapons he's going to because he has like his strength build, right? It's not like a limited version of a strength build, it's the strength build. And then, you know, everything's fully optimized for any situation he can come up with, which I think is really good for new players, but for people that have seen it all already and know how to weapon swap and know how to do these things, it's just like, all right, man, you know, keep doing your thing. I'm, you know, proud of you for your success and stuff, but like, I want to see the wild, weird shit that people can come up with. That's why I like Decker. Hey, Decker, make magma sorceries work at 90. <laughs> He's like, they're terrible. Sounds good. Let's go for it. <laughs> oh, I missed a lot of shit.
I'm technically good at the game, but also very creative with builds. It's an amazing combo. Thanks, man. And thanks, Donnie, for saying I'm your favorite ER streamer. I appreciate it. 1v1 me, nerd. I bet you couldn't even pancake me once with a pancake and hater weapon. I'll fucking hamburger flip you while dying, dog. I don't got any pride left. It's almost like they put 308 weapons in Elden Ring so you can try out all of them instead of just sticking to 10. What a wild concept. <laughs> I could never do ladder because of having to fight one of five setups. Well, that's why I liked uh, Tarnished Chimp. Like whenever I fight, whenever I fight Tarnished, we have a completely different um, duel because he goes way out of his way to match my off meta shit. Like we we dueled on Max's stream. Um, I forget what he was using. I forget what he was using, but we had we had like three really good duels. And he's just like, dude, I've been using uh, uh, Wing of Esta with offhand baby rattle in ladder fights, dude. And it's hilarious, winning winning with an offhand flail. I'm like, dude, that's amazing. I could never do ladder because I find everything they use boring as shit. But you saying that is really awesome. <laughs> Boondocks reading reference. There you go, breathe the free air, my friend. Let's go. I will never understand why DS3 music is so, it's so loud, it's insane. Let's go to the character creation. Uh, I'm an inverted gamer, guys. Camera speed 10, auto raw recovery off, let's go. Um, I try to stream of another- When the chosen savior PvP. Oh my God. turned away this? from his duty. So loud. The fire keeper took charge. What? And five kingdoms gifted her five thrones to aid in the Firelink ritual. It's so loud. And receive souls brought by an emissary of Emmas. What? The Firekeeper's champion. Yo, what's up, Air? Welcome in, dog. Uh, what's a good dex grease for DS3? I mean, lightning's the best one for regular DS3 because it has the least um, uh, resistances. But um, uh, dark is really good. The issue is that if you have the hornet ring and you do dark damage, it for some reason you do less damage than if you didn't have the hornet ring. I'm going to love your black metal magma build at 80. Let's go. <laughs> Lightning or dark? Yeah, about the greases, yeah. Wish people knew how good Crozier was. Smo hammer? Oh, I love Smo. Is Crozier a ledging weapon? Uh, yeah. But the issue is you gotta be really close to them to get exploded. Flails, my beloved, I live for the clank, click, clack of family heads. I know you do. The hyena build is great with the health and steeple main hand and the family heads offhand. Sound settings don't affect this for some reason. <laughs> I think it's just a movie. Maybe I could go edit the movie settings in a video editor and replace the file. Yo, Fanny with the Fanny. How you doing, big guy? Right, so far, I think our name's gonna be uh, Torpy. Gotta be a lady, you gotta be a lady. All right, what do we got? <sighs> Night build. Um, I'm gonna put the sound back up. Okay, Night build. Um, Level 9, Vigor, Endurance, 16 Strength, 11 Dex, so not the usual spread. A little less Dex than usual. A lot of Vitality. So if you guys don't know, Endurance and Vitality are blended in Elden Ring. So um, Endurance is obviously your Stamina. Vitality is your um, uh, Equip Load. So you have to balance the two, whereas in Elden Ring they combine them to one. This looks pretty good. This looks normal. I like the uh, I like the scaled shoulders. I like the uh, the shin pads and the thigh pads. Shield's got a nice little symbol on it. Little dagger on the waist. I wonder if that's probably just um, that's probably just for show, right? I like that helm though. It looks pretty good. It looks a little bit like a Sleepy Jack Daw build, to be honest, but not quite. I think Sleepy would prefer something like a, like an open-faced helmet. <laughs> Why is Goku caked up? Dude, if you've never seen Dragon Ball, everybody's caked up in Dragon Ball. 
<laughs> All right, fugitive. Well, that is a weird sword. That's like a gobbo sword. All right, so we got one more vigor, more endurance, less vitality, but but strength and dex. So when I play these mods, I usually like to do quality so that I can try out a lot of weapons. A fugitive is an option. I like the uh, I like the pockets. Pretty cool. Reminds me of the altered uh, Vagabond set in um, Elden Ring. I like all protective armor, but yeah, don't you like the um, the soldier helm that has the open face? I see you wear it all the time. Quality would slap. We'll see. I mean, I, I'm not against using magic. I, I really don't mind using magic in these games. All right, the duelist is a dex build. Every every build's been level nine so far. 17 decks. I haven't even looked at side weapons. Oh, this one starts with a buckler. All right. Scholar. Another level nine with a nice hat. So this is our wizard. Okay, we looks like we start with soul arrow or an equivalent and a dagger in the in the in the second slot. That's pretty good. It's more about the historic realism vibes. I gotcha. You don't have to get too crazy with your weapon stats. There's a lot of hybrid weapons like an ER. Cool. Cool. I do have a soft spot for Pyromancy in DS3. It's probably my favorite build. The Demon Scar Pyro is probably my favorite build in DS3. Followed by my Braid Blade Dex build. And then followed by my Ring Knight Paired Greatsword Strength build. And then after that, probably my level 60 quality build. It's quality, but I have 36 strength and uh, 18 dex so that I could use the uh, Black Knight Great Axe. But I could also use the Ring Knight Paired Swords and uh, Lorien's Great Sword, which fucking slaps at 60. People, people get hit by it. It does like a half of their health. They're like, what the fuck just happened to me? And I'm like, dog, this weapon gets buffed <laughs> and I know what I'm doing, so I'm going to hit you. All right, priest? Whoa! Of course the priest has a fucking... <laughs> has a fucking mallet. Hyena, do you have one of those? Don't lie to me, girl. I know you got one of those lying around somewhere. You probably got a fucking Hello Kitty one of those. All right, so the priest starts with heal. No uh, offensive stats. I like the metal armor. I like the mail. Looks pretty cool. I don't know about the pants. They're they're a little MC Hammerish, but an Outcast. We've all been level nine so far. All right, so this is like super fucking um, luck based. We have a catalyst and a curved sword. I wonder what that spell is. Can I go over? No, I can't. Interesting. Looks like a black orb. I don't know if it's a fireball or a. Like a black hole you put out there. We'll find out. Hello Kitty Mallet? <laughs> what are you on about, goofball? I like how it calls back to the cleric set in DS1. Yeah, it does. I was so surprised to see the cleric set is super heavy in DS1. Yeah, dark spells. Hunter. Well, I know what Shalir would be playing. because She likes doing bow-only builds in these games. But sadly, I am not a bow-only enjoyer. Look at that hat, though. It's great. Ooh, Crestfallen. A lot of vit. A lot of vigor. Low other stats with a, with a regular old spear. I don't think that's a partisan. Might be a partisan. I think it's just a spear, though. I don't know. Kind of boring. Yeah, what's up, Delamberg? How you doing, guy? That mod really makes me want to play DS3 for the PC. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how it is. And then we got deprived. Guys, I want I kind of want to start deprived. And just see what happens. To be honest, none of these are making me like want to play them that much. I kind of want to start deprived and see what we get. That's what I think. 
Yeah, for a mod, there's actually very few classes. In Convergence, you get like <laughs> 20 classes to, pu to choose from. I'm gonna do Defraud. Starting gift. Hmm. Raw gem might might help. I kind of want to do no starting gift. Let's just do wretch with no starting gift and see what the game gives us. Do I have any favorites saved? No, it doesn't go back to my thing. Very slim. Yeah, Black Fire Bombs is super, uh, super popular. All right, our favorite, our favorite time. Let's go. Old, old. Now let's do a young voice with the old, old face. Physique, muscular, big head, small everything else. <laughs> Fanny with the one. Let's go. Oh, yeah. This is going to be very hard to look at. Any different hair? That's oh, all the same hair. Actually, should we do just stereotypical pigtails? Let's do pigtails. There we go. Green and purple, baby. With the unibrow. Perfect. Little mustache. There we go. Looking good. Big eyelashes. Green eyelashes, baby. Oh yeah, it's gonna be terrible. Oof. That looks amazing. Woo! Oh my god, this is looking so much better than I thought it would. None of them seem to be doing anything. I love it. All right, where's my, uh... Oof. Face shape, there we go. <laughs> Cinders is good. Um, Cinders is a good starting point, but it ain't, it ain't the best. Right, we're just going to fucking rush through things that I know are going to be silly because I kind of want to get into the game. I don't have a long time. We're doing the Legendary Legend League tonight in uh, Elden Ring. So if you guys are on PC, oh yeah. Oh, that's amazing. And I uh, want to participate. We're going to do, uh, we're going to ledge in the Kalid Tower on the beam, baby. Oh, man, I got to make them go up. There we go. Woohoo! Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, that's good. Big Shanaz. 
Oh yeah, that's great. Oh, this is, it's growing. Oh yeah. Oh, it's amazing. Nostrils. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Perfect. Gorgeous. Just incredible. Very happy. There we go. Thick. She is ready to roll. I think we're good. Maybe some chin. What does anti-chin look like? No, I think we gotta go chin. I think that's gonna be the best bet for ridiculousness. Whoa, that, that makes the nose smaller. No, thank you. Arch chin, low chin, wide chin. Thin chin? Now we're going into Waluigi territory and I am all about it. Right, let's just make it look like a fucking penis sticking out. I think that's what we're going for here. All right, I think we're good. We got Torpy, let's save that to favorites. All right, Torpy deprived, no starting gift. <laughs> Ready to roll. Let's go. <laughs> Very loud. Let me know if I gotta change it at all. All right. Let me try to lower this on here just a tiny bit. Okay. All right, and we're off. Don't need this. All right, gamers, I'm here. Not to make friends. Oof. Okay, a little bit of frame issues. That's okay. And the computer's just gotta get used to it. What do we got? We got a soul. We got a lightning urn already. Who needs a starting gift? What are these things? Yeah, I know how to play Dark Souls. <laughs> just gorgeous. Thank you so much. All right. Uh oh, uh oh, didn't see you coming. Didn't see that guy. Woof. Does this heal my whole thing? It does. I am light rolling and it is messing me up. Oh. Woof. Oh my god. He's so fast. Oh my god. Well, that was terrible. <laughs> we got a broken straight sword. Let's go. All right, buddy. See ya. Where's the next enemy at? <laughs> oh my goodness. We're going to be trapped in here. <laughs> I got to get this shiny. I got to know what it is. It's a skull. Oh my God. There's two guys now. Wait, I didn't die. How did I not die? I have no health and I took damage. <laughs> oh, what's through here? The demon vanguard. What a cool 
Guys, they reused the fucking demon just like all the games. Crowd shots. What you got? Jump? Nope. Please don't have a sit option. <laughs> Yeah, we're halfway there. There's a... Oh, shit. No! The fire killed me! Oh, that's unfortunate. Born in Lothric, she created the Nexus out of her own free will. Thanks, Firekeeper. All right, well, we died. Scripted death. We were so close. I didn't know that um, fire was going to come out. Oh, my God. Torpy's so handsome. Well, little bit of cake. Little cake, though. All right. You're talking soft there, guy. So I may find guidance in the wisdom of saints. Hello? Oh, dear, forgive me. I didn't see you there. Allow me to introduce myself. Hello? Greetings, traveler. I am Erwin of Karim. Erwin? A disciple of the Archbishop. I was sent here by Apostle Morn to retrieve a wayward saint. Thanks, Thorn. By the name of Irina. She is my dear sister. <laughs> I like how it turned out. Due to end. But we have received no word from her, nor her knight. Wait, he moves? He moved over to me. Oh, dear. Uh, he's repeating himself. Uh, well. Who are you? No, no, no. I see no dark within you. I have no need for it. Okay. Bye, Mr. Scottish guy. I'll uh, try to bring you an iron brew uh, next time I come through there, bud. Okay. I hope y'all are having a great day. Whew. Hey, it's Firelink. Look how cool it looks. Wow, looks like we got Gwendolyn. Looks like we got a giant. Some sort of prince. And two things I can't uh, figure out right now. This is cool. We got the Ash and Estes flask. Hello? Greetings. I am Ebrius, famed sculptor of Vogan. You know, craft my face? Well, the fire looks fell, great, yeah. I escaped with my life. That looks great. And I've been traveling the world ever since. I sell wares myself. If your curiosity calls, I don't think you'll find a better inventory anywhere else. Yeah, we got our merchant. What we got? Hundred souls for a firebomb. Ooh, we got a dagger. 300. Definitely gonna get one of those. Little leather shield. Okay, I'll be back, big guy. What other kind of gamers we got? We got Andre! Hi, Andre. Oh, wow, I'm not moving forward right now. It just makes you move forward. Oh, no, it doesn't. It just, wait, does it continue it? Yeah, once you start walking when you wave, it, it, make, it doesn't let you stop. <laughs> that, that's cool. What's up, well. bud? You, I'm Andre, if it requires me. Oh, he's the guy! I could transpose there? Okay, regular Titanite shards, sounds good. Alright. Let's uh, get into the friggin' mod, huh? 
We got night gear. Let's go. And a blade. I don't recall seeing you before. Are you new here? <laughs> yeah, I'm new here. Yep. The name is Thomas. I'm certainly no stranger to this. This nexus. If you plan on visiting one of the archthorns, I'd be glad to lend you my. If you have any baggage and need a rest. Oh of shit, we got fucking storage box. Wild. Without breathe. Hey, Dark Souls fans. This. The throne is shattered with many small cracks. Alright, so what do, what do I do? Do I go to the back of the throne? Hyro, you're fucking getting in the wires again. Get out of there. Fucking loves wires, dude. What's up, Tish? Uh, the first installation didn't work. So we sat for like an hour waiting for it to install, but we're good now. Mm. No decks allowed. And by the way, guys, if you haven't seen me play a game for the first time, I talk out loud all of the time, just whatever I'm thinking. I'm never asking for an answer. I'm never expecting an answer from chat. I don't like spoilers. If I want a spoiler, I will say something like, okay, chat, feel free to spoil this for me, blah, blah, blah. But like right now, I'll be like, gee, I wonder what's behind this door. I don't want somebody in chat to be like, it's locked. I'll be like, hmm, I wonder how I get to the first arch throne. I wonder how I get to the first world. Well, you go up to the chair and you, you blah, blah, blah. It's like, I'm not actually asking. Hyro is not a good electrician. He is a terrible electrician. Can I can I get up here? And not. Huh. Do I talk to these things? Yeah. I talk to you. Welcome to the Nexus Lost. I am a firekeeper. I tend to the flame and tend to thee. The arch thrones. Spoiler, are there are arch thrones? So that the link Get out. of the fire may commence. Get out of here. If thou <clears throat> Oh, sorry. Throws, I didn't mean to do that. Then take this. <laughs> Ooh, there Lost we go. That's what we needed. Produce the coiled sword at the bonfire with the seal of the Nexus upon thee. The arch thrones will allow travel to other world. Okay. Gaming. Oh! Crash. Crash. Yep, crash. <laughs> First crash, let's go. <laughs> Boom. In the, in the comments, a lot of people, um, a lot of people have that issue. <laughs> I wonder if it's saved uh, that we put the sword in. <laughs> Aldia sends their regards. Hey, it's a squat. It is in there, let's go. That's all I care about. Um, you know what? Andre, can you, um... Can you... He cannot. Huh, he doesn't change my Estus values. Yeah. Well, let's go into the mod. Whoa, I can do this. What, I just pressed continue. Oh no, a lot of Estus. Wait, what? I thought I was going somewhere. You fucking with me, well lady? Done. Thou art now an emissary of the throne to collect enough souls to satiate the arch thrones. 
Thou must travel to distant realms. Approach the backside of one of the thrones, and the rest will follow. Ah, uh, I was right. I just had to talk to her first. All right. Which one to go to? Hmm. I think most people are going to go left, so we're going to go right. Like a gamer. Go to this one. If they're if they're too tough, I'll find out. <laughs> Ooh, the cathedral. All right. All right. I like this uh, atmosphere. Hey, I didn't explode. The Infinity Gauntlet doesn't open from this side. Gaming. All right. What do we got? So I can go this way. <laughs> Might as well go down here first since I'm exploring, right? Oh, I hear gaming. Hello. Oof. Oof. I tried to change it like an Elden Ring style and it fucked me up. Oh no! Oof. It's a doggo! With a human face! Oh my god. Dude, get out of my face. Celestial Poopa? What the hell is that? Oh, no, no parry for Derby. No parry. I want to parry you, you nerd. Get over here. There we go. What? Oh, come on now. Dog, I should have reposted you. you. Jerk. Can I still get back here through there? I can. Humanity? What in the world? Restore half of maxing HP or reverse hollowing. Oh my goodness, they friggin' did it. This reduces FP consumption when mixed. When mixed, when in flask. That is some confusing English there, devs. But I'm sure it'll make sense. Oh my god, a soup boy. I don't need any soup. I'm good. It seems like on the third swing, uh, I lose my stagger ability. Rubbish, let's go. Saint Tree Belvine already? Allows for faster casting than ordinary sacred chimes. Well, they kept that. That's good. Imagine if I become a fucking faith build. Oh, shit. We got a spike club, lady. Hello. Hi, yo. Oh, the jumping R2. I forgot about that on the regular club. That almost got me fucking wrecked. Oh, she wrong caught me into oblivion. Woof. Wild stuff. I wonder if she drops anything useful. She is a beefcake. We're going right back. 
We're going right back. I will say, enemies are way hard. I don't know if uh, it's because I'm batting up a thousand or whatever, or I'm uh, playing up a division, but uh, holy cannoli. What's up, guy? Good thing I got strike damage so I could fucking stun him. Oh! Alright, so if I use a humanity, I wonder if it works like a ember. Or I wonder if there's embers in it. Oh my god, where'd you come from? You jerk! Oh, not to a dog. Dude, I don't like that I knocked them away. I want to just hit them. Oh my god. Terrible. Go get this shiny. Ooh, a lizard. Hi, lizard. Uh-oh. There's a gamer right there. Oh, he's a roll catch god. Oh, we lost the lizard. We lost the lizard. Oof. I don't think they could fit through here. Let's test it out. Hey, lady. All right. I don't think they could fit in here. So that's pretty good news. Oh! Oh! Beefy lady. Bye bye. Give me your spike club. Give me your spike club. Damn it. That would have been so dope. She has the meat. Where are these nerds? Where'd they go? Uh oh. All right, no backstab for that guy. Well, I'm scared of that guy. That's, he's got the fucking beefy dudes in the Ring City's fucking the Herald Curve Sword. Italian Night Shard Gaming. All right, let's see if we can bamboozle him. I just want to see what's over here. Doggo! So the trick is the corner of the doggos. That way they can't get smacked away from me. Lizard! Oh my god, I'm not gonna get this lizard. You kidding me? Nope, I knew I was not gonna get that lizard. Oh gosh. Can I at least get the shiny? We got our second tight right shard. Oh. Can we just not do this on the stairs, please? Is that okay? Oh my god, I thought I rolled that. Nope. Goddamn delayed attacks, man. I got this feeling that we are punching up right now. But we're gonna keep going. Oh, we got these gamers. The strike damage does seem to have a nice uh, effect on all the gamers. It's just too bad I can't do the R2 for the club because I'll jump and just get smacked. No, you're not allowed to attack me. You're going to fucking grab me. Another humanity. Let's go. That lady's living the good life, cool walking stick, reads in her pastime, gives warm hugs to passersby. That sounds amazing. Gets fucking 
back massages by strangers? Oh wow, perfect. What, you go to jump or some shit? Go. Give me your friggin' mace. God damn it. Lizard time. What do you drop? Ooh, a raw gem. We didn't need to fucking... We didn't need to start with that. Out of my face. If we could find a goddamn fire gem for the dagger, we'll be fucking sitting pretty. All right, lizard, go up against this friggin' wall. There you go. Hey, we got it. Dude. You are strong! Holy cannoli, dude. Oh, that's terrible. Um, hello? I think I need to turn auto recovery on because I am just getting stuck. What's up, big guy? Bounce, 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 that's four. And a jump? No, just four? Uh oh, out of the stamp stuff. No, I didn't mean to roll. I fucking pressed it, but it was like two seconds before and it, it queued it up. God damn it. Uh, like I, 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 I pressed it and I let go and I was like, all right, I hope it doesn't queue up the roll. And it did. That's a big oof. I think going this way is faster. What if I get his sword? That'd be incredible. I'm a big fan of using uh, cool stuff that I get in the beginning of these games. Until late game when you usually get something more ridiculous. But it seems to be just the um, Herald Knight curved greatsword, so... I want something new and different. Anyway, we're getting more souls as we as we keep fucking dying and killing things, so it's really not that big of a deal. What? What stunned me? Dude, this shit is so loud. Yeah, you can level up weapons. Oh my god. How is she stunning me? I don't see what's happening. Give me your friggin' mace. God damn it. All I know is when she gets up, she stuns me. If that's a mechanic, that's fucking wild. Damn it. All right. Three Estus. Let's get this nerd, huh? I can hit him while he's standing up. Oh my goodness, he fucking back. What the hell was that? He like hit me with the back of his knee. Get away. Get away. No way. No! Dude. Last time he did five, and then he did fucking six and a swipe. I mean, I could bonk all bosses with this, but I want a cooler weapon. I just want to start with nothing so I can see what the mod has in store. Like, what they let you get. But I gotta say, this place is pretty boring. It's just the cathedral, so... We're gonna see what we can do about just running through. I do wanna kill this guy, but I don't wanna keep killing everything every time. Not what I'm interested in. So we're gonna see how long the aggro range is. Go grab my souls. I think that was my fourth death. 
Oh my goodness. Was that a ridiculous reach, dude? Oh my god. Perfect. At least those fucking spider things aren't chasing me. Oh my god, it, it does stun me whenever she gets up. That's a ridiculous mechanic. Uh, wretch. Or deprive. Whatever that version is. Dude, that fucking stun when she gets up is ridiculous. Give me your, give me your mace. God damn it. Alright, time to get this nerd. We got it. We got this. He did the same fucking move that last last time, dog. What? No! Why did the what the fuck just happened? Did I landed on the tree and didn't give me my plunge attack? Oh my god, the launch, dude. Yo, is this is this serious? Oh my god, then the dog killed me, dude. Dude, is this is this serious right now with that tree? Alright, I think that's five. Oh my god, Nightbot. I don't want to cool down on this. Just let me fucking tell everybody how terrible I am. Oh my god! There we go. Woof. Alright. This is cool though. I feel I feel terrible again. Hate fucking whiffing on the dogs. Yeah, I'm going to get. Oh my god, my souls are up there. Perfect. Amazing. I cannot believe still that the tree stopped my plunge attack. What a jerk. Yeah. Oh, oh. Dude, why can't I, what? Are you kidding me right now? I can't get a repost on this nerd? I'm sorry, but I should be able to change my weapon and get a fucking repose. A little ridiculous to me. All right, bud. Five million times the charm. Well, never mind, I guess. It's not the charm. I'm gonna swing. I think two hits is safe on that move. That. 
Oh, there's a dog over there. I can't go that way. I go back this way. Damn it. There we go, we did the plunge attack. What'd you drop? Murky Moss! And like a hundred souls, what a joke. Increases absorption when mixed in flask. Okay. Interesting. Well, I do believe we have seen everything over here. So let's go up the stairs! Yay! Well, we might as well upgrade. Go back to the Nexus and get like a shield and a dagger. What are our level ups looking like? Very well, take. Six hundred. Let these souls withdrawn from their vessels. Farewell, emissary. Wait, was she about to say the strength be granted so the world might be granted? Ah, it is good to see strength? you. Oh good my help, God, it's so loud. Everything's so loud. Like, I don't want to talk to you. Oh my God, Andre, you're so loud, buddy. Calm down. What's up, big guy? What do we got? Albert, scimitar, short sword, dagger. Give me that dagger, bud. <laughs> Let's do a leather shield. Might need a torch. We'll get a torch just in case. You right. will. Thank you for the day, man. Here we go. Gaming. Uh, level up. Very good. Can I get some of that uh, health stuff that the kids are talking about? A so hundred so more good. HP. Farewell. You can't teach that kind of stuff. Can I travel from here now? Cannot. Yo, 100 more HP? Let's fucking go. Did I finish my soda? I got a little bit left. Let's go. All right, time to go up. We got a shield now. Whoa! Oh my god, I hate that the strike fucking makes them go back. I guess it's okay. I just gotta use to push them into the wall. No zombies! A store of greatsword? Yeah! Well, now he can't get to me. Ha <laughs> ha, jerk. Old greatsword! Ooh, Gale? Oh my god, I think we're gonna use this. What can I do to get down? There we go, loincloth? 69.6, .6. let's go. Oh my god, we got a greatsword already, get wrecked. Y'all don't even know what just happened. I could have just gone up there. That's a place to go. Interesting layout. This does look awesome. It's like Gale's sword, but uh, more raggedy looking. Uh oh, I don't need any soup. Give me that hyper armor. 
Oh my god. Yes. Oh my god, it locked onto the rock! It locked onto the rock and not the dog! Dude, what are you doing? Oh my god. Oh, the lock on in every single one of these games is garbage. Yeah. Yo, that didn't stun him. That was a fully charged R2. Oh my god, I don't want soup. I'm full. Dog. What is your hyper armor? Oh my god. I don't want soup. Oh, we're already out of our goddamn heels. Hey, we got footman's trousers. Ooh, they're really good. Holy shit. Holy cannoli, those are really good. We got to uh, get some lighter armor so we could uh, equip it. Actually. 71.6, huh? Yo, 69.6, baby. And we can see our beautiful face. Hi, right, what's up, nerd? Oh my god, 113 damage for a fucking repost. 87 for a regular R2. R R I would say that's not worth it. Oh my god. We could try it with the dagger, though. Nope. Oh, he missed. We got a partial, but he didn't give it to me. Uh-oh. Hmm. Ooh, scary music. Oh, gaming. Murky. I saw a murky in their hand. That's a little frightening. Probably got a murky with a projectile in this game. Okay, I don't want any more soup, bud. I'm good. Uh-oh. It's not letting me pick stuff up. I got an SS shard! Let's go! Alright, six times ain't bad. This knocks him back, too. Okay, so if I charge it a little bit more, I think an R1 and an R2 are good enough to kill that dog. More jerks. Oh, I forgot about Ashes of or uh, Weapon Arts. Dude, why would you lock onto that guy when I'm staring at the dog? What the fuck is going on here? Oh my god, there's another dog now. This is terrible. And another dog. Uh-oh. Bye. See ya. Bye. We'll be seeing you, nerds. Oh, we got to help me carving? Oh, it's a good thing I started running. Oh my god, we got more stuff. We got more stuff. Let's go. I'll take that, dude. We got a full armor set and a help me carving. That death was super worth it. All right, what do we get? Iron priest hat, thick cloth veil worn by warrior priests who are famous for being unwavering in battle. It is said that they were entrusted with a duty, still its nature is yet to be revealed. Now that sounds like a mod maker's uh, dealio. Oh my God, it weighs more. Well, this weighs less. This, 4.6. Oof. Your beautiful face. 
Um. These are just so good. Well, let's just keep using new stuff that we get. Fuck it. Oh, wait. We got an essence shard. Can I upgrade here? No. Do I go to Andre? Dude, help me carving is the fucking goat, dog. You know we gotta add that. Actually, let's just do it down here. Perfect. Do you give me that? Good one. He does not. Pretty. Wait, does it even do what I think it does in this game? Increases usages of Estus Flask. Give to the Firekeeper. Hello. Let's go. Go. Give me five. I agree. I like the carving. I like dropping them on the ground. <laughs> all right so now i don't really have much to explore we're just gonna go uh back to where we die and try to get as many shinies as possible all right oh oh let me turn on my fan i was wondering why i was all stiff Let's go, gaming fan. Dude, the running R1 is fantastic. Give me that hyper armor. Nerd. I gotta remember how I got there because it was a little bit of a journey. I think we went up here. Got attacked by a dog, went down here. If it's one dog, we're gonna try to kill it. Oh, it's two dogs. Two dogs, abandon the plan. Nope. Oh no, I fell. Oh no, I'm stuck. No, there's three dogs now. Three dogs down. Oh my goodness. This is terrible. And I'm gonna get smashed, yep. All right, so that is a dead end. Look at it, we got, we got blubber in our face. All right, I'm not trying to do that anymore, fuck that. I like the look of this armor. I feel better. Feel good, play good. That's what I always say. All right. Um. Hmm. What, Hyrone? You're good, big guy. Oh my goodness, dude. I disagree. Okay, buddy, give me one second, okay? I'll let you out next time I die. Oh my, and it just happened. See, that was for Hyra. I did that on purpose. He wants to go outside. Now I want to be a nice, nice doggy dad, so I died. Because I'm nice. All right. Just uh, one second, and we're going to continue. Is there a pose I can do? There we go. <laughs> Don't forget and handsome. Let's go. Oh, all right. Go like this. And I will be right back. Love you guys. I don't think we counted my last death. Oh my God. There we go. All right, BRB. I'll play some music for you while I'm gone.
All right. We are back. Let's go get fucking wrecked again, huh? Oh, wait. I gotta get the sound going. There we go. Yo, what up, Ducky? How you doing, big guy? This game, this mod is tough, and I made it even tougher by starting off as wretch and uh, trying to go outside of the norm. We, we might have skipped an area. But either way, it's, it's good for DS3 to feel fucking tough again. All right, nerd. Oh, wait, I can't parry that, everybody. Oh my god. <laughs> dude, this dude has wild hyper armor. Alright. Still at work? Uh, well, at least you're making that money. And Arts Rose is good. I had a little bit of an installation issue, but we figured it out. And now we're just gaming. Uh, I've seen other people in areas that were different than in DS3, but this area is in DS3, so it's a little changed and modified, which is pretty cool, but um, I still was kind of looking forward to seeing like fully mo modded out places. Oh. Oh my God, dude. Damn it. Uh oh, I should've done that. Shouldn't have done that. Yeah. We're getting Titanite shards though, so I can start upgrading my weapons. I'm just stoked I got a poke greatsword already. All right, maybe we won't die this time. Maybe we will, who knows. We didn't die this time. Definitely gonna die up here though. There are so many enemies. I don't want any soup. Yeah, I don't like when I aggro dogs as well. Dude, I locked on the dude behind me. What the fuck? Oh, dude, what, like, what? Oh no. Are you kidding me? Uh, more soup nerds. Oh my, dude, it turned the camera all the way around. Oh, we got one of these nerds, too? Oh, my goodness. This is terrible. There's a shiny up there. Timing. Okay, what the fuck? I need that shiny. I need it. We ain't doing anything else till we get that shiny. Pyro, I really need you to shut up, my guy. I love you, but, like, you're constantly trying to get into the wires. You're constantly fucking crying. I don't know what you want, my guy. I don't know what you need. I don't know what, I don't know what to tell you, bud. You had me all morning. You're going to have me in a couple hours for a while. There's shiny over there. There is a shiny over there. How do I get to that shiny? What is that? Looks like a humanity. That is something that's in the DS3 DLC that you see when you get to... Like, that's a humanity. We have humanity in this mod. But, um... In DS3, when you get to... The Dusty Place? Whatever the fuck it's called? You, uh... Those are the enemies that come out. So it's a modded version of that. They made them a little darker. <laughs> Dude, you need shinies. You never know what it's going to be. You never know. Besides, if you don't know that I am a goblin, then I, I don't know what to tell you. I've literally given, like, people that I was dating rocks before, thinking it was a great gift, and they were like, what the fuck is this? And I was like, what are you talking about? It's a shiny rock. It's super cool. They're like, uh, I deserve better than this. And I go, okay. Bye. <laughs> if you don't like shiny rocks, this is never going to work out. Have a nice life. 
All right, so I think this nerd drops a Titanite shard. Oh my God. Well, I'm not gonna find out. Not gonna find out. We're gonna continue. Shit, I take a shiny. You'd be surprised, Ducky. Some people think they're better than, than shinies. I don't understand it. Doesn't make sense to me, but reality of the, wor of the world. All right, second try. Overbone. Goddamn dog. I don't want to lock on the soup guy again. Yeah, I need this. Get an ember. I thought it would be a fucking bone dust. Young white branch. Okay. Got him down there. Young white branch. Perfect. Right. Can I fucking get over here, please? Thank you. Something died. I don't know how. Maybe a dog jumped off the cliff. Okay. Please. Let me get the shortcut. Let me get the shortcut. Pretty please. Doggo! You're the worst. How did I miss you? Oh, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Get the shortcut. Yes. We got it. Oh, my God. You're the worst. Oh, my goodness. Cathedral Knight Great Shield. I mean, fuck this. I ain't got no health. And this dog goes down here being the worst. Can I can I aggro you over here, bud? You wanna come over here? Not until I hit the ground. Damn it. Wrecked. Alright. Yeah, you're a jerk. This dog's a jerk, too. Oh. My. God. <laughs> I can get, get crushed, nerd. All right. <sighs> right, let's go get wrecked again. Your charge attack. Oh my god. Oh my god, the delays. Are you kidding me? Of course. Of course I miss. Right, you're out of the way. Two, three. Get wrecked, nerd. All right, drop me a goddamn shark. Celestial Poopa. We love Poopas. Feeling exhausted is real right now. Howdy again. Gamers. What up, Carrier? Welcome back. All right. Um... Too many dogs in this level. Too many dogs. Dogs are trash. Don't need any more dogs in this game. My only complaint so far. Hell is up here. A dark caster. God. Backstab. Correct. Buck pellet. Just gotta make sure it doesn't open. 
Yep, nothing. Jerk. Dead. The secret shinies. Oh. Secret shinies. Okay. What's defending this? Oh my god, the crap the crawling murky nerd. Oh my god, dude. Murky Moss. Bye bye. All right, nothing from any of these nerds. Yo, they were like swirling around him, dude. Hi yo! Oh my God! Perfect. That's a claymore. Give me your claymore. Give it to me. I want it. Give me your claymore. No claymore. Badge. Oh my goodness! These enemies' hyper armor is ridiculous. What's gonna fall down? Nothing. It will charm. <sighs> what we got over here? This looks terrible. What the fuck is that? Mini spider nerds. Oh my goodness. Those are terrifying. Rusted gold coin. Okay. Fuck, dude, do I have enough? <laughs> do I have enough fucking chutzpah to make it to the next goddamn area? Oh, we didn't fucking roll when we jumped. Oh, we did that time. Interesting. Oh. Listen, buddy. I don't like you. You don't like me. Let's just get out of each other's face, okay? Perfect. We got. I'm telling you, we are, we only got one decent uh, drop or pickup from a shiny, which is this fucking sword. And I guess the one armor set, but... Correct. Oh, jeez, the DS3, dude. Or the, the DLC, dude. Ayo. Wrecked. Secret crawly dudes? Get out of my face. Get murky. Of course they hit me. Soul of an unknown traveler. We got a gate. Yo, we could gatekeep? Let's go. First gate opening, gaming. Oh, no rusty gate noises? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Bye. See ya. Ah, I can backtrack and try to get you later, bud. Sorry. What are you gatekeeping? There's a shiny down there. I see it. Keep your fucking maw away from me, nerd. Oh my god, it's a brain sucker! Ah! No! No brain sucker. See ya. Oh my god, this looks so cool. Oh! What the fuck? Did you just Cyclops me, dude? What? Oh, they look so cool! No. Oh my god, send me down. Yes! He sent me down! What a good guy. He did it. 
He didn't have to, uh, he didn't have to fucking knock me onto the elevator button, but he did. Oh my god, are you a real person? You're moving. No way, Bloodborne in DS3. Yo, what, <laughs> what up, God? <laughs> Bloodborne, very pog champ. Oh my god, we made it in here. Please, please no boss. Please no enemy. Please just let me fucking rest and come back. A Crescent Axe. Cannot use it. Okay. Little roar. Crash. <laughs> no weighing all day, baby. <laughs> all right um i feel like we might as well level up while we are here before we move on <laughs> we might level up our weapon too we've been getting some shards let these souls withdrawn from their vessels manifestations of disparity Elucidated by fire, burrow deep within me. How much do I need to wield this? Is it 14 strength? 14 strength. Yeah. 2,000 souls? Holy shit. Well, very well, burrow deep within me, retreating to a darkness beyond the or... of flame. Let them assume a new master. Ooh, 35 HP, that's pretty good. Casting themselves upon new forms. Need that. Yo, we're up to level 10. Farewell. Let's go. What? Well, I like this weapon, so we're gonna upgrade it. 636. 636. I got 104. I need 550. Looks like one of these. One of these. Let's go. Upgraded weapon time. Upgraded this weapon one. gaming. Oh my goodness. I feel so strong. Damn, I still can't wear any of the hats. I got 31 poise with these bad boys on, dude. Fuck. Oh, looks like we're bare fist parrying. Fuck them, that's what I always say. Uh, oh, I don't go here to go anywhere. Crazy. All right, Cathedral nerds. Yeah, what up, Angie? Welcome in. Just finished eating at work. Let's go. This is Demonborn 2 Arch Thrones Boogaloo, basically. This game is super cool. This mod makes the game hard again. Now I just got to backtrack because we missed a shiny. I ain't missing a shiny. We got another titty. Let's go. This mod is very nice. You wish you could play it maybe one day. We missed that shiny too. All right, what's this guy's do, do fucking deal? Can I sneak up on you? I can. Let's go. And R2 does as much as a backstab. That's good to know. Get fucking Shrek, dog. Can I kick? Uh oh. Whoa, it sucks me in. I can't do anything. Oh, the shield bash. I yo. Nice. Drop me some one of your shit. Nothing. 
That was a quick 600 uh, or 550 souls, something like that. I right, brain sucker. Do you have hyper armor? He does have hyper armor. Terrible. Whoa. Okay. That was a lot of hyper armor, dude. That was two swings of a greatsword. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, go get this shiny. Oh, yeah. We're doing more damage now. Oh! There you go. Give me your goddamn mace. One humanity. I mean, it'll probably come in handy, but like, come on. I need, I know I wanted a fucking cool. Whoa, look at this. Hello, hello. Little Siofra meets the cathedral. Uh oh. Well, that looks fucking scary. Looks like there's more suckers over there. Goodness. Yo, Nog! What's up, big guy? What's going on? <laughs> How was stream? How was the old Master stream, Nelson my guy? Just traded with seven viewers. Welcome, Spuddies. Welcome, Spuddies. <laughs> uh, let's go back and level up one time. Why not? Had had a chance to raid. Let's go. Nox first raid. Guys, Nocturnal just got affiliate today. So, um, give him a congratulations. Give him a follow. Let's keep his fucking stream growing. Welcome back. Stream was fun, but I kept having ideas for stuff to do to improve it offline. Yeah, man. Anything you need, I'll help you. I already told you. Let me know. I need more of that health stuff. Always health. Oh, I don't need to go here. We haven't even gotten to a boss yet. <laughs> Can you? Im That's my new pickup line. Hey, do you need to be improved offline? <laughs> Thank you for all the support and backup, dude. Of course. I consider you a friend, Noct, and I fucking help my friends out. And uh, I also have enemies that I've made by no fault of my own. <laughs> and they can go fuck themselves. So, the way I see it, if you're my homie, then you get help. And there's really no confusion about it. And if you're a fucking dickhead, then uh, you can go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh my god! More gamers! Where'd you go? Can I backstab you? Oh, the jump! What? What a defense against backstab! I don't think I can backstab them. He keeps fucking jumping out of the way. Out of my face. <laughs> I have to return the favor of the friend part, not the enemy part. Of course, man. Hey, you can backstab them. Ooh, look at that animation. Oh my god, it's the it's fucking Bloodborne. We are playing Bloodborne right now. It's not big enough, hence why I need your help. Listen, size doesn't matter, man. It's it's the magic that you got. Are you going to frenzy me? Well, that looks terrible. Please don't frenzy me. <laughs> there, he's fucking cursing me, you fuck. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? What a scary looking creature. <laughs> Noodle arm douchebag. <laughs> 
Ooh, we got a ring! Our first ring, let's go. Oh my god, that's a lot more damage. Holy shit. 18 more AR? Fucking let's go. What? Okay. I'm so afraid these are gonna have fucking hyper armor. Get wrecked. Oh! Oh god. The hyper armor king. Oh, he grabbed me! Good thing I wrecked you, nerd. A thing hidden over here. Before we go down there, let's explore up here. We got more, more fucking mini spider dudes. Counter damage. Get wrecked. Oh, he wasn't dead yet. Nerd. Looks so cool. Yeah. This mod would be really cool to play, like, in the dark. But, like, I gotta have lights on for streaming. Man, this game looks like it'd be amazing in the dark. We got a talisman. Let's go. <sighs> All right, secret time. What is up here? They do look cool. They look scary. Another goddamn sucker, dude. No backstab. What is that? Oh, it's another suck in, dude. That's so cool. The hyper armor. Are you kidding me? Dude, that's a fully charged R2 and he just fucking walks through it. Oh my God, dude. I'm not even swinging. I'm running away. Another pupa. What the fuck is the pupa again? Reduces FP consumption. I don't even think we explored the top of Firelink yet. I wonder if there's a secret up there. Here. Nerd. That counter damage though. Right, I saw one hanging. There he is. I think he's gonna come down. Oh, from behind. Fucking jerk. Oh, dude, what the, f it's so slow. Hey, later, Porky. Have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging out. You're going to go into this blind? All right, Ducky. Sounds good. Thank you for hanging out, guys. All right. Um, what Hello. is in here? Hello. Hello. I've managed to get captured during my research. Oh. If you facilitate my escape, we could be. No captured. way! It wouldn't let me roll because of the fucking words on the screen. Get fucking trolled, Terpy. Are you kidding me, dude? Are you kidding me right now with that? I couldn't roll because of the fucking. Words on the screen. What a troll. Yeah, help me escape. Also, fuck you. I'm a, I'm a problem. Oh, my God. Well, now we know we're running in there and running right out. Fuck that shit. <laughs> That's like one of my biggest complaints about Elden Ring 2. What the? I didn't, I didn't press L2, I swear. I didn't press anything and I just fucking L2 <laughs> I 
let's send this back down. Can we run through everything? This nerd looks like it could be a problem. Okay, no, not a big problem. Gonna stand back. Endless. Well, we aggro the fucking bloodsucker. Perfect. Oh my god. No! No, not happening, dog. Ain't happening. We're gonna aggro everything and run through this door. Go. Two nerds down. And come from behind? Nope. Correct. Dude, I was fucking coming out of a backstab. How did you hit me? Oh my goodness. You are the worst. Nerd. All right, nerd. What the hell are you want to say to me, huh? I can't even talk to you anymore. Oh my goodness. What a troll. All right. We got walls. We got bloodborns. What a graveyard fucking sword. The Gravelord sword. Oh my goodness. Where do you get the balls to do that kind of shit, huh? Hello. Easy game made for fucking nerds, dude. This game is tough. This mod is tough. I like it, though. This. Harvest ingredient. Murky moss. Whoa. Harvesting in DS3? That's weird. Over here. More nerds. No. You're gonna get back, Steph. That's what's gonna happen here. Bam. Just got home. How's the mod so far? Gonna take it for a spin soon? It's great. Fucking endless. You made me get toxic. Oh my goodness, endless. All right. Not reading chat until I'm done with this. Endless with the troll. <laughs> I'm a toxic gamer. I know this. That's why you're my mod. Get out of here. All right. Uh, it's good. It's tough, though. We started as a wretch. Or a deprived, whatever the fuck it's called. It is tough. All right. We got a nerd. Nerd alert. I'm coming in hot. Dude. What? How? How did you grab me if I'm rolling around you? Oh my god, he's edge clipping, bro. I got the hyper armor. No. Oh my god, it didn't give me a backstab. Amazing. What the fucking shit, dude? Are you fucking kidding me? What? Oh my god. That, now the game's just fucking with me. Now it's just fucking with me. That's what's happening. It's just saying, fuck you, Turby.
Drop something cool. Damn it. Fuck. Oh, I got one heal left. All right. Murder. Yeah, they cranked that enemy up like crazy, dude. Look at these nerds. What'd you drop? More celestial poop. They love dropping poop. I got a feeling they're gonna. There's an enemy that's gonna come out of the ground. Herald armor. Nothing. I look at all these nerds. What? No way that missed. Oh, there's an actual brain sucker. Nope, no thanks. No, thank you. Perfect. I love when they jump like that. It's super realistic. Perfect. No backstab for old Terpy. What? He's going to grab me. He's going to grab me. I was mid-roll and he grabbed me. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me right now? Fucking jerk. Let's use an ember. Fuck it. YOLO. Dining? Sacred Bloom Shield. I'll take fuck it. We got 6,000 souls from this expedition. All right, let's wait. Harvest? Dude, we're gonna fucking harvest ingredients in Dark Souls 3. That's fucking crazy. What'd you drop? More poop! Yeah, Elden Ring backstabs in fucking DS3. Booty! That's a good one. That's a good one. Right, what's what could be waiting down here, huh? A elevator. Ooh, a blessed gem. That's nice. Where the hell is this gonna go? A fog wall. Perfect. No thanks. I don't have any Estes. <laughs> no, thank you. We're going to go back to the bonfire. Hopefully there's a fucking shortcut over here. Harvest. <sighs> nope. I go back this way. I hear a nerd. Open. Go. Ooh, just a hole? No elevator. All right, shortcut acquired. Let's go see what the hell that boss is, huh? Ooh. Where you at, darling? There you are. 
bit. Let these souls withdrawn from their Ooh. vessels, manifestations of disparity, elucidated by fire, burrow deep within me, retreating to the darkness beyond the reach of flame. Let them escape. It has to be the charge. Well, One titty shard. Bless him. Well, let's go see what this boss is. I'd be stoked if we could get fucking one boss on the first day of Arch Throne. What are we looking at? 858 health. Beautiful. Almost 200 AR? Let's fucking go. Nope, not. Wait. Nope, I go back to this. Nope. <laughs> Get out of my face. Uh, I rolled into the fucking column, dude. Are you kidding me right now? <sighs> Big tired. All right, what the heck's behind this wall? The Great Deep Accursed. Ah, oh, shit. This guy looks tough. Oh! Bloodborne. Oh, let's go. Oh my god. That was queued up for so long. No way. This is like the uh blood blood uh starved beast or the blood boiled beast or whatever the fuck it's called, the one the headless one in the dungeons. But also a mix between the, uh, Harl. Because, uh, whatever. Oh my god, this fucking moveset. I love missing at point blank range, Miyazaki. I know it's not Miyazaki. Matazaki. Mod Headshot. Uh-oh. Second phase, what we got here? We got a caterpillar again. It's just like that beast. Oh my god, please don't poison me. I don't want to get poisoned to death. Again! Okay, can that fog go away, please? Please go away, fog. It didn't want to go away. Oh! What? It won't let me fucking get near him. What? Okay, this moveset is ridiculous. Dude, you're one hit away. Let's go. Gaming. <laughs> Woo! We got Ember, Soul, the Great Deep Accursed, Heisel, Scroll, and Homeward Bone. And there was a message under the thing. I don't know what it said because we got items instead. But we beat it with 55 health left. Let's go. <laughs> it's Blood Johnborn.
First try gaming. I don't think there's any secrets over here. Yeah, the bloodletting bees. I know it's not blood star because that one's all poisony. But yeah, the bloodletting bees, dude. Is this lady a strand? No, that's a statue. All right. Well, we beat a boss. Go. We didn't get any keys or anything, right? We got a scroll. Um, let's use one of these. And we'll go through and see... Um, what uh, the rest of the cathedral has. Manifestations of disparity, elucidated by fire, burrow deep within me. There we go. Treating to a darkness beyond the reach. Looks like we're turning into a fucking uh, strength build. <laughs> As I always do. Let's probably get a couple of, a uh, few of these. I will probably need them. All right, rest of the cathedral, what you got, buddy? What the hell is going to be up here? I feel like there's going to be some gaming coming up. What's up, big guy? All right. We could fucking backstab this big boy. Yeah. You going to drop anything? Nope. Good. All right. We got spiders. Get wrecked. More murky moss. You were shiny? Spider man. It's more like spider boy. Spider boy. Is a scary nightmare boy. Does he have milk? I want to try. Spider boy. I do like when I get to the point where my uh, flasks feel like they're not even close to what I need. Murky boss. What's up, jerk? Oh my god, there's so many spiders. What? How did I not go through the door? Oh my god, dude, really? You guys are stuck? Hamburger! We got, we got Bloodsucker and a fucking douchebag over here. Oh my goodness! What the fuck was that? Okay, so that's an AoE push. Followed by the Gravelord fucking bullshit. Oh my god. Dude, panic, panic rolling commenced. No way. Nope. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. No way! This has to be a joke, right? Oh my god. 
No! Nope! No cursing me. Nope. See ya. Oh my god, I have no health. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Six health. See ya. Alright. I ain't no punk bitch, though. I'm just not getting fucking cursed. Wait. They died. They fell off. Totally a part of the plan. Get wrecked, nerd. Easy game, made for babies. Up! Dude, these fucking spider things are scary as shit up here. I don't think those are missing shiny or anything. Counter. Nope, no secret shiny. Okay. Uh, just like normal. Drop down here. Oh my god. I don't know if I have enough health. Fuck it. I'm glad I did that. I don't think I had enough health. Woof. I think they're uh, susceptible to piercing damage. Perfect. Well, I'm a little apprehensive about walking across that bridge, so we're gonna go up this way a little bit. Okay, we got bl blubber dudes coming up. No way! He didn't even lock on to me and I just ran into that? Oh my God, I'm terrible. That was ridiculous. I think Chad is just in awe of how fucking terrible I am right now. Alright. Who's gonna be in here? Oh my god, it's a boss. Perfect. What do we got? The Saint Biden... Charge is the weapon art? Let's go. Well, let's take the risk. Let's fucking go across the bridge, huh? We got a fucking cathedral night. Oh my goodness. See ya. Pit bye. Open the door. Open, 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 open. Oh, he's, he's swinging. He's swinging. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, he's a drill boy. Oh my god, this fucking dog's the worst. Knowing me, the dog's probably gonna fucking fall down on top of me. Oof. There you go. Just get out of my way so I can run away. There you go. Yeah, buddy. Why I didn't I didn't press anything, it just made me get up. Alright, we're gonna try whatever's behind this fog wall. And then I'm gonna feed Hyro and take a break, and then we're gonna do the legendary legend league in uh, Elden Ring when I come back. I've never done this. I've never stopped stream and then took a break and then started stream again, so I hope it works. Very well. Let these souls be drawn from their vessels. Manifestations of we want that 800 health. And we're gonna go buy more shit. Hey, he gave me a bone shard. What? 
How the hell did that happen? We need it though, we don't have another one. Uh, I got three of those. I don't think we need repair powder. Buy some bombs. Fuck it. Do I give you my bone shard? Nope. Burn undead bone shard, let's go. I don't have another one, right? Nope. Nice. Yeah, the music is dope. Oh, we go this way now. I do like the um, the pathing in this. I like when they're all uh, connected and shit. That's why I didn't like Lords of the Fallen. All the shortcuts that they gave you felt unnecessary. They felt like they didn't offer anything. They was just like, oh, look, another way to get back to the fucking bonfire. It's like, dog. <laughs> I want this to feel special. Oh my goodness, doggo. Out of my face. Definitely gonna need some more endurance at some point, but that's definitely like low on my uh, to-do list. What's this way? Probably another fog wall. Okay, I can go down. Let's see what's behind this fog wall. The sound is so spooky. Hey buddy. Dude, I kicked him and nothing happened. Oh my god. That was a backstab. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? I'm rolling through all of that. No. <laughs> There we go. Give me something cool. I want a shiny purple chest piece. You jerk. What are you doing over here? All right, that gives me a little bit of uh, Estes back. Oh my God, they're fucking crawling this way. How about no, Mr. Slug Guy? All right, what? What boss is this gonna be? Is this gonna be a fucking another slug boy? There you go. What could this possibly be? Saint Klimt. Oh, wow, you look cool. You got Ma. Oh, he's all stretchy like the Godskin Apostle. Oh my goodness, you have a lot of health. Oh, perfect. Oh, let's go. Oh, man, I don't understand their poise values. But it's nice that you could fucking stun them. Oh man, I thought that was gonna fucking poise break them. Damn it. There we go. Yeah. It seems like it's like five R1s. I wonder how many R2s it would take. That's two. Oof. 
Three? Oh, I missed. Oh. He walked away! That was a lot of time. I don't think it had to do with it. Damn it! Get back here! Don't do a ritual! Don't do it! Uh oh. Worm boys! Did he kill them? Where'd he go? He got some health back. Oh, the camera moved out. That's pretty bad news, usually. Like a worm? Oh my god, it's Solaire! Well, hello, Bloodborne. Oh my goodness. I'm playing Bloodborne right now. <laughs> my least favorite Bloodborne boss is back. This is terrible. This is pretty cool. What a good mod. Look at this shit. Oh my God. Can I fucking break one of your legs or some shit, please? What is happening? Oh, the slide. Dude, I feel like I got to get an attack in. Oh, my gosh. I don't feel like I can attack anywhere without getting hit. I feel like I gotta break one of those legs. Wait a second, who the fuck is shooting at me? It's not this guy, it's somebody else. Oh my goodness. It's like those worms on the top or some shit. I don't think I'm close, I don't think I'm gonna use a humanity. Yeah, I saw it's the priest that's uh, riding the creature. I was just focused on um, changing the torch instead of instead of talking. <laughs> the mod's pretty good. It's tough. Damn, 70% fat roll. Thick pants? There we go. Yo, what up, Osiris? Good to see you, bud. Um, This mod is fucking cool. It, it feels like I'm playing a mixture of uh, Demon Souls, Bloodborne, and uh, DS3. Oh, I didn't want to go this way. I want to go the other way. Oh, away we go. How many embers do I got? Two more embers. All right, we got two get out of jail free cards. This boss is fucking cool. If you just got here, Osiris, get ready for a fucking really cool uh, boss. Uh, yeah, we got a lot of winter lanterns for sure. It is dope. To be honest, I've seen some other people stream this game. And I've seen some cooler areas than this, but this place is a lot better than the uh, vanilla version. <laughs> All right. Get out of my face. I'm just happy we had, we found a fucking sword with a poke R2 right in the beginning of the game. And I started out as a wretch, or the deprived, at level one so that I could respec, if the game lets me, so that I could try out a whole bunch of different builds. But we've become a strength build. But soon I'm going to start qualitying everything else. and We'll be back to being a try everything type build. I'm just not going to spec for stuff if I don't have it, you know? Like, why waste um, shit? 
We did get a scroll though, so we could go in intellect. All right, nerd, I'm coming for you. Hello. Oh my God, already. Ah, the fucking jump back. Oh, I fucking rolled that. These hitboxes are nuts. The jump backs always piss me off in these games. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, the fucking wrong catches. Oh my god. Dude, what the fuck? He wasn't hitting me with any of this shit our first fight. Now he's hitting me with everything. Dude, you're pissing me off now. Of course. Of course. Well, we gotta move his, learn his moveset, but our fucking first fight was way better than this one. I honestly feel like our twos do less poise damage than our ones. Right. This phase two is fucking garbage. Oh my goodness. You're such a noob to the Souls games. Ellen was your first and I find it hard to jump back because I am such a fan of the open world concept. Um, Dark Souls 2 is really similar to Elden Ring as far as that concept, but uh, DS3 has the most similar combat, so. What I would suggest is to really try to get into the combat and uh, explore that as much as you can. But I think DS3 is really linear. Sorry, I think it's less linear than people say it is. I think it's very fun to explore the world of DS3. All right, how the fuck am I gonna do damage to you? And chat, I don't want anybody to tell me. I'm only asking questions so you can hear what I'm thinking. <laughs> I know this is a wild concept, but but I, I'm sharing my thoughts. <laughs> I know, what? Crazy. <laughs> Oh no. Oh god, I missed the stop. Oh my god. I feel like if I hit, keep hitting the same thing over and over again, it'll, attempt, it'll eventually like knock him down or some shit. Cause I'm not doing any fucking damage to him. Oh my God. Oh! I'm really afraid to look at chat guys. I feel like I'm gonna see a spoiler, but we're gonna see, we're gonna see what happens. <laughs> Design wise is the type of bosses you missed in ER, the really fucked up ones. Yeah, I agree. Who ordered the spaghetti and meatballs? I did. I'm running the wrong way. ER's creepiest boss is like the tree snakes. Uh, what, the ulcerated tree spirit? <laughs> you think you're going to get a new bike instead of a PC so you can play with us in my Tondra's Tongue runs in the legendary Legend League? <laughs> I think with Elden Ring, they really went away from the uh, from the messed up, creepy bosses. Which is so whack. Like, when you go back and you play Bloodborne and fucking... Um, like, Demon Souls with the fucking... Um, the, the Phalanx boss. It's such 
weird concepts. And you get an Elden Ring and they're all like, you know, creatures. Like, they're all like, makes sense. Eero's groupiest boss is Celibus. <laughs> You need to be more active. Got a bit of a belly. I do too. I gotta. I gotta up my uh, exercise for sure. Steam page the monster with a bulbous head. Let's go. <laughs> Ronnie stole your dog. I don't think that was your dog, bud. I think he's a free, uh, free spirit. All right, last try before I gotta feed Hyra. So. Let's go. Let's not waste Estes. Got the fucking back steps. Dude. Oh my goodness. What a jerk. Oh, guys, I don't think we've been counting my last couple deaths. I think I'm the only one that's been counting my deaths. Which is kind of wild. Don't you guys want to fucking talk shit about how terrible I am? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? <laughs> what, what, what kind of miss was that? Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. This is the last shot of the of the day. Let's uh let's really go for it. Oh my god, the back steps! I really can't fucking stay on the back steps. I know they're in almost every Dark Souls game, but they really piss me off. Look at that shit, dude. Are you kidding me? You shouldn't be able to jump back in a fucking U-shape, dude. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> oh, there he goes. Is there anything I could do to stop it? No, they're invincible. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm an impressive gamer. How could we ever talk shit about you? Oh, trust me, it happens every day. <laughs> ah! All right, how the fucking shit do I damage you, motherfucker? Like, I think I should attack these legs. But I can't hit them. What? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is cursed. Dude, there's just so much shit going on. And I can't hit it. Oh my god. There's some shit happening. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I just, like, there's no openings. It's just constant bullshit. Oh, God. What? <laughs> I'm moving. Oh, my God. Is this serious?
Oh my god, I can't get close to it. Oh my god. What the f what the fuck? Dude, I I what what? What do these do? Seventy-two damage. That didn't hit it. It went right through it. These hit boxes are terrible. Dude, what the fucking shit? Dude, are you di what? <laughs> Lightning urn, I choose you. No damage! Perfect! Incredible! No damage! <laughs> Wonderful! Oh my god, every time I hit it, it fucking does damage to me! <laughs> Is this, like, what the fuck are you doing? Oh my god, L literally every time I hit it, it does damage to me. Is This has to be a joke, right? This isn't real? It has to be a joke. There's no way this is real. This is way too much shit. It's impossible to fucking dodge it. Oh my god! This has, this is a joke. Right? The devs are watching me right now and just laughing. Like when Polly made the fucking boss invisible in Wonder Ring and he was just laughing in chat. That's what's happening, right? I literally can't attack it without without taking damage. This has to be a joke. There's no way this is real. They're, they're, somebody's laughing at me right now. There's no way. There's literally no fucking let up. L literally, every single time I attack, I take damage. There's no way. There's no way. This is a joke. This is a, this is a joke. <laughs> well, looks like we got to go get a shit ton of fire bombs before we attack this motherfucker again. Some more heals would be nice. My goodness. Well, um, I got to take a break. And then... um. Feed Hyro, and then I'm going to come back on, and we're going to do Elden Ring, the Legendary Legend League. So, um, I got to go. I'm not going to rain anybody. Love you guys. And um, I'll see you in a couple hours. Bye, gamers. Mwah.